Hello friends, welcome to Kizang's Kitchen. Today I'm going to share you how to season Korean stone pot before the first use. You need warm water and uh, dishwashing scrub. So basically, scrub, scrub, rinse, rinse. Scrub, scrub, rinse, rinse. Please do this like three to four times. After few scrub and rinse, fill the stone pot with warm water almost to the full and then turn on the flame starting with the lowest please make sure the flame starts at the lowest because if you put the flame the high medium high the stone pot is going to crack so we have to gradually increase the heat after half an hour turn the flame to medium and let it simmer for another half an hour and then drain the water. Please make sure you use a thicker mitten or thicker gloves or since the stone pot is very hot. Let the stone pot cool for 10 to 15 minutes and at this time all the water should be observed and it should look very dry. And now it's so now we can go ahead and apply our seasoning oil here I'm using uh, sesame oil I mean you can use any oil as per your preference you can use even clarified butter or avocado oil also please make sure you do not touch the stone pot directly because it, the pot might still be very hot just be very careful when you do this and pour the sesame oil and with the help of paper towel just spread it all across I mean inside and outside all over the pot and uh, you will see the oil being observed so keep adding more oil if needed and then you will know when it's done once the oil stops observing into the stone so just evenly apply keep applying it inside outside your stone pot is ready where you can cook delicious stews you can make bimbimbap and uh, I'm going to be posting a lot of videos where I will be sharing with you uh, recipes from Kingdom of Bhutan where I'm going to make ema dazi, kewa dazi and stews and uh, many many more other food that I'll be cooking in the stone pot so look for the videos below friends and uh, today I'm just going to share you a little small video where I'm making a bimbimbap which is my variation of bimbimbap which I enjoy very much thank you for watching and uh, hopefully you'll also go and get a stone pot and start making delicious food please do not forget to like share and subscribe